have never heard of this dam, but it holds back a lot of water. It's 30 feet high and 300 feet across, and it forms a lake of about 22 acres. Studies dating back to 2011 have shown that this dam is in serious need of repair, but that could cost up to four and a half million dollars. Earlier today, officials said they've had concerns dating back to the 1980s. We spoke to the general manager of a dam in Northern Virginia about what goes into maintaining and managing a dam. He says it's no easy task. Regularity of maintaining and managing and monitoring lake levels or reservoir levels in a dam, you know, all depends on the size of the impoundment uh, and what the impoundment's being used for. Now, since 2014, localities have been trying to work out a plan to fix the dam, and they've come up with two potential solutions. Armor the dam for overtopping, repair or replace the low level outlet uh, to improve the existing bridge and utilities to withstand overtopping. The second choice is to remove the dam and return the area to wetlands. Replace the embankment with a bridge uh, to construct wetlands where existing lake bed exists to stabilize sediment, regulate and improve water quality and create recreational and aesthetic. Uh, make it aesthetically pleasing. So not sure which way they're going to go, but the immediate concern is to get it past this current crisis. Officials said late this afternoon that it appears the dam is stable. They want to let the weather pass and release some of the water through the spillway and take some of the pressure off of it. And we will keep you posted on what they decide to do.